Cambodia's economic growth is expected to slow down in 2020 if the European Union (EU) withdraws the everything but arm EBA trade scheme. Its economy is projected to grow by 6.8% next year, driven by continued export growth and strong construction activity, IMF recently said. The British retail consortium BRC said though the country added 576,000 new jobs compared to a year ago there are 36,000 fewer jobs in retail than there were a year ago making it the sixth consecutive quarter of decline for retail employment Bangladesh's minimum wage board recently recommended Taka 7100 as gross monthly minimum wage for the workers in the leather goods and footwear sector raising the wage form uh, existing Taka 3652 the board also incorporated a provision of 5% yearly increment on basic pay The area allocated for cotton cultivation in Nazarbayevjan in 2020 is 105000 hectares the country's agriculture minister Inam Karimov said recently as per the new subsidy mechanism which will come into force in 2020 $129 $129 will be issued to farmers for every hectare of sown cotton and $58 for each ton of harvested cotton the minister said Indian men are more avid online shoppers of apparel than women according to Nielsen's report on shoppers behavior while making e-purchases women seem to have a higher penchant to try out new clothes before buying the study finds that men contribute 58% to the total online clothing sales compared to just 36% by women After doing away with the one-time PVC packaging from their supply chain, Aquila and its parent company, Taste International, have initiated a program of evaluation and planning to take care of the recycling and energy issues around manufacture and use of industrial gloves. Tadashi Yanai, founder and chief executive officer, CEO of Uniqlo's parent fast retailing. will resign as an independent board member in December and after 18 years to focus on his fashion business Japan SoftBank Group announced recently The global trade value of wool not carded or combed has been consistently escalating with a high CAGR of 7.55% from 2015 to 2018 according to data from Texpro The global trade of wool was 8139.5 million dollars in 2016 which increased to 9726.6 million dollars in 2018. The total trade of wool has risen by 8.19% in 2018 over the previous year. <music>